guys I am back and we're gonna talk about this hair hey guys so let's get into this hair I got like lipstick on my hand and I feel like I'm just gonna rub this all over myself and I'm gonna be pissed later so get that off me so um of course this is the hair boutique I curled this hair today um because I'm a procrastinator and I said that I was gonna um, curl it and then still didn't curl it but um I did spray it with some argon oil um, hairspray after um, I curled it and this is why the hair is such you can see a wave or curl today because of that and hopefully it stay in for like a while it should um I did a little pompadour in the front yes being different um and I like it different different like to be different I um still digging his hair I don't have that um smell in the hair anymore so I really think you really need to wash it a couple times just to get that smell out I get a lot of compliments on this hair um this is like my subdued hair you know like this is what I will run out to the mall you know if I have nothing in none nothing that I planned on doing and my hair is still twisted I will just like throw this on and be gone you know if I had time to plan and I know I'm going somewhere I would probably go with another wig because I like color and being a little bit different or whatever but um this is like my everyday hair and I love this hair um even though it does not hold a curl I think there's other ways to uh, you know to go around that by with the hairspray when you curl it spray it with some hairspray and try to ho you hold off um, the curls for a little while and not raking your hands through it that's why when I'm moving my hair I'm moving it all in one big clump because I'm trying to keep the curls the way way that they are um, I curled the I, curled, I had a babyliss one inch curling iron and I have a babyliss um, flat iron I just curled yeah I curled it backward or whatever and still sprayed it with some hairspray and I feel like it's a little too high but you know whatever um, and also use got to be um, styling gel just in the front part of it just to you know keep it together and also give it a little reality in the front um I just I love this hair and this is Filipino hair um I think it is 222s 220s and a maybe an 18 inch closure I think it's 18 inch, 18 inch closure but yeah I am in love with this hair um if I'm, I may be wrong with the limbs, I have a video, it's called um, Hair Haul, and it has all of the hair that I purchased and the limbs of them. I know this is the longest one, that's why I'm thinking that it's 22. This is a true 22. Um, it's very long, and I am just, I feel like, again, because I, I mentioned this in another video, this hair is, is expensive. It is very expensive. If you can catch any sale that they're doing, jump on jump on that sale. And plan accordingly. Like, you know, Christmas gifts, a birthday gift, or um, uh, the different, you know, holidays and stuff. I know this, uh, this, this may be over, but Halloween, they had a sale. I think it was like 10% off. And, um, well, I think it's like, like like um 4th of july memorials day i think they norm a lot of companies do like christmas and thanksgiving and they do sales and stuff i think that's like the appropriate time to try to um get this um type of hair the hair is phenomenal but if you want a lot of length not length but more volume you will have to go with more length not more like more bundles you would probably go need to go with like at least five or six bundles no that's crazy mm, nobody won't do all that but if that's the the vision of what you have it's very voluptuous big hair you gotta go more bundles with this they're single wefted and um it's just not a lot of hair on um it being single uh, single wefted but I do find that this Filipino hair is heavy very heavy so even if you want to go five or six 
be aware that it's heavy. I just feel like mine with four bundles, I still feel like I could have used another uh, extra bundle. Like I could have used like that fifth bundle. But um, I still like it um, the way it is. But it's, it's very heavy. I first got this hair and I made this wig like in summer. This is not summer hair. Filipino hair is not summer hair. This had me sweating like a little piglet. I was just sweating and sweating and sweating. This hair is dense and heavy. And I would not recommend getting this for the um, summer. No. Mm -mm. Um, other than like my, Cam my Cambodian hair, I love that hair. That hair is more suitable for the summer. Not this. This is heavy. And I would wear this, which I am going to wear this in the... Um, winter i probably will get another um some more hair that is all black that i can wear in the summer because i just i can't i can't do this i can't do this it's too hot my my, my foundation was melting no i won't do that to myself so i think this is like a like two thumbs up i love this hair um i get tons of compliments and people want to touch my hair and uh you know, I feel like I did a good job with the wig and um, placement and everything and curling. So yeah, I'm I'm loving this hair. I think this is worth getting, but I would I would want to save up for this. This is something you save for, you know, like a goal in mind. Yeah, this is a, something. This is a splurge. This is a, this is a splurge, but I do love it a lot. So this is me saying goodbye to this hair um, and I'm going to do um, I think the last one um, hair that I had was Live to Love and I think the next next maybe a couple videos not because um, I'm I am doing a haul and um, I really I, I probably gonna do um, that hair um, next week so yeah so bye to next time and thank you for watching.